Hi, Ted here from Bear Cleaning. Just want to give you some tips on keeping your food caddy as free as you can for maggots and uh, clean as possible. Now with this heat, it's really hard to stop maggots. Whatever you do, you physically can't stop them. They're gonna get in, they're gonna get in. Um, so here's what I do. I use trace fluid, very small amount, cold water on a brush. Here's my food caddy. We uh, had it emptied yesterday. There was a couple of maggots at the bottom. We bag all of our food waste, uh, tied tightly, still get maggots, one of them. Um, so what I do is I start with the J fluid. I just put a small capful into my bin. J fluid is very strong smelling and good, but that smell will kill off the maggots. I fill the bin or half fill the bin with water. Get the brush, it's quite a stiff, it's quite a stiff brush. Uh, get that wet, give it a swirl around. Clean all the edges, all the sides, the bottom. I can really smell the, the sort of uh, the smell from the fluid. Even do your lid, because those eggs can get in anywhere. Okay, we'll wet the brush. Just close the lid, go over the top of the brush, because that is a real good place where these little blighters will get you. And that's it, I leave it. Hi, it's Ted again. Uh, so I've left the bin for about an hour. Let all those uh, nice clean smells get into the bin. Hopefully kill off all the eggs or things, nasty that you've left in there. I can't get rid of this water in the normal rainwater drains. You can get fined for that. So if you can, if you've got a nice uh, space in your garden for uh, getting it away in the bushes, that's great. I'll always rinse it down afterwards with fresh water just to get rid of any smells or anything else to not attract any flies or if you've got access to a, um, a sewer drain then you can get it down there so here's ours all emptied out nice and clean um, I massively would recommend putting your food in a bag newspaper's great but when it soaks up the water the smells get into it the bag just keeps everything together and hopefully on Monday it'll all be starting over again